Hello there, it's Lance here from Wellsbridge Motorhomes and today we have a 2018 Autotrail Amala 625 Lowline Edition. Lowline means it is the two berth version, perfect for a couple. It's a rear lounge uh, model with, with long enough for two singles at the back or a big double. And above the cab area, the reason why it's low line is instead of a bed up there, you, it is replaced by storage. You have cupboards up there for storage. Um, it's on a Fiat Ducato 2.3 turbo diesel. It is a six-speed gearbox. And this is the 130 brake horsepower. And it is one owner from new. It's done just under, I believe, 7,500 miles and it is 3,500 kg in gross weight, weight, which means anybody with a driving license can drive this. Okay, so let's go along on the outside. Okay, just so you can see the motorhome. We've got the electric step here, just to get inside the habitation door area. And then you have below your rear lounge window, this is a storage area to underneath the rear lounge. In fact, sorry about this, if I can just get this open. There we go. We can see inside the storage area. So it goes round to your left, but then it does go a little bit further on as well. Okay. Okay, so we'll just come round to the back of the Yamala 625. So it is a 2018 and above the rear lounge window is a reversing camera lens. Okay. Again, you've got another access point to underneath the rear lounge from the other side as well. And you do have just above a TV aerial on the roof, just to, in between the bars there. And then you have your, your normal gas locker and Fetford toilet and the mains hookup point, as well as your fresh water filler is the other side of the motorhome uh, and so on. So you've got your release for your fresh water down below as well. And then your wastewater release down there as well. So let's go inside the Amala just so you can see the setup. Just close that door too, but you can see there is an auto trail umbrella there as well as the bin on the habitation door. And we do have a, I won't get out of the way, but that will shoot across and that will be a, hab, a fly screen going right across your habitation door area. Okay, so into the cab area, we have your six speed gearbox there. You do have cab air conditioning as well. And then you do have, by the looks of it, you've got a nav button there, potentially for your sat nav and it is Bluetooth connectivity as well. And you've got the media button here also. And then you've got your cruise control stick just here. And there's your Fiat Ducato steering wheel. And you do have built-in blinds all the way around the cab area, so you can shut that off entirely if you want to. Um, and then we have got one of the seats swiveled at this moment in time. You can swivel both seats if you want. This is a swivel seat also on the driver's side. Uh, so just above that, you have got a roof light. And then, like I say, you've got your storage in the, well, above your cab area. You've got cupboards either side. I can open the two here for you, so just so you can see inside them. There you go. And I so say you've got one on the other side as well, as well as a little a few little cubby holes going around. Okay, so just before your passenger seat, you do have your freestanding dining table there. You've got the recess for it. Now you can put that obviously into your rear lounge or you can put it outside. So we'll get to the rear lounge in just a minute, but if we go to the kitchen area first, you see you've got your kitchen sink, and then to the side of that, 
you pull this up and you have two free uh two uh, sorry free 240 sockets which you can use cleverly hidden away let me put that back and then underneath your kitchen sink you do have your freeway fridge i can't pull it out just because of the it is cat by the looks of it catching on the carpet but okay inside you have your freezer going across the top and obviously the rest of your fridge uh, and then to the side of that you do have your full-on cooker so you've got one electric hob here and then three gas burner hob and then you have your grill and then your oven and then beneath that you've got some storage underneath that and above the cooker you do have a microwave that's fitted as well and then you've got your free way reversible fan there also Okay, so opposite the kitchen area, you have this big door here. Now this is going into your washroom. Uh, this is 6.35 meters in length, by the way, the Amala 625, this particular motorhome. So you do have a separate shower to your toilet, so not all in one wash, uh, wet room, which is nice. It's a separate shower, we'll start with that. It's a lovely space. And then this is where you have your fet for toilet. And then you've got your, your sink area here. And again, I think you've got just a little potentially more storage there. Yes, you have. And then you've got your mirror just there. And just below, you'll see you've got blown air heating vents. And that's going around the motorhome. And here's your convector. So you can use your gas bottles for your heating or you've got your mains here as well. You can use the 230 volt ultra heat. And here's your wardrobe space. Just before we get to the rear lounge, the decent size. I say it's gonna be perfect for a couple, this motorhome. Loads of room, plenty of floor space, nice amount of storage and the big rear lounge, which is definitely big enough for two singles we take the cushions off either side or you can have if you want to make it into a really big double you can do that as well um, where the catch is below take that off and pull it this way and you can comes out wooden slats and then you put the cushions across to make a big double bed and once again you've got more storage going around the rear lounge and the cupboards above And all the windows have blinds and fly screens on them there. And you, this it does have a TV in it, an Avtex television that's been left in, fitted to the bracket already. And you've got all your TV points at the back there. 240, 12 volt TV point. Okay, so if you wanna hit our YouTube subscribe button there, the subscribe button, and you can keep up to date with all the latest videos that we'll be posting. If you want to give the sales team a call, you can on 01487 812901 or 01487 815511. We will post in the, in the description down below uh, a link to the website homepage and also a link to this actual vehicle on our website with all the specification and if you go to our website you can from there on the home page at the top uh, you can join our Facebook page also you can join our Instagram page thank you